Our editorial staff wrote in the Winter Issue Digest of 2006 an article entitled, School Success of Chromaglass. We are pleased to offer a video that has just been recently completed that reviews the subject of the article, the Hepburn Lycoming School's Wastewater Treatment System. It is important from the perspective of many environmental issues as addressed by high exposure chromoglass sequencing batch reactor or SBR installations. This chromoglass system has complied consistently with many state and federal parameters for the discharge of treated effluent to Lycoming Creek without the use of an effluent filter. The sequencing batch reactor has the capacity to treat wastewater for 350 students and 35 staff members that generate an average flow of 2,600 gallons per day with a maximum flow of 6,000 gallons per day. The influent biochemical oxygen demand, or BOD, and influent total suspended solids, or TSS, are approximately 270 milligrams per liter each. Varying influent flows that are often experienced at most schools are effectively managed by chromoglass wastewater treatment systems. Due to typical school calendars that include vacation time and limited weekend use, influent flows fluctuate greatly. The use of a programmable logic control, or PLC, allows the operator to program changes in the automation and adjust controls for system settings. Moreover, the chromoglass system has sensors to detect high and low flows, which trigger the PLC to automatically adjust cycle timing, thereby preventing system upset. The use of chromoglass sequencing batch reactors for school applications has been successful and has demonstrated the production of satisfactory effluent quality. For several decades, school applications of sequencing batch reactors have been made in Dubai, United Arab Emirates, Tortola, British Virgin Islands, Colorado, New Jersey, and Texas. The most recent school application was made as a stream discharge at the Hepburn Lycoming School, a rural elementary school that is located along Lycoming Creek in the Susquehanna Valley of Pennsylvania. Over the years, the Hepburn Lycoming Elementary School has expanded to include more students, staff, and classrooms. That required an upgrade to its wastewater treatment system. This upgrade was the installation of a chromoglass model CA60 sequencing batch reactor with an accompanying 1,300 gallon sludge processing tank and 750 gallon chlorine contact tank. The accompanying data illustrates the ability of the chromoglass sequencing batch reactor to produce an acceptable effluent under varying influent flows. Operation and maintenance of the chromoglass system has proven to be easily performed by one operator on a daily basis as required by the Federal National Pollutant Discharge Elimination System permit. With the possible requirement of a total nitrogen discharge limit for this stream discharge, the current sequencing batch reactor can be easily modified to achieve nitrification and denitrification.